In a move that surprised everyone, the former Premier of Queensland, Peter Beattie, is aiming to come out of political retirement to contest the marginal seat of Ford at the federal election. The star candidate is expected to shore up Labor votes in the Sunshine State, but Tony Abbott says the Prime Minister should watch his back. You don't get this sort of media crush with the announcement of any old candidate. But Peter Beattie is no ordinary candidate. Move back a bit. One half of Labor's Queensland Double Act. I'm Kevin, I'm from Queensland and I'm here to help. Uh, his name's Peter, he's from Queensland and he's here to help as well. I'm doing this because of what I think is important for Queensland. Two comeback kids, a resurrected Prime Minister who personally rang the one-time Premier to ask him to contest the marginal coalition seat. People know who Peter is, know what he stands for and he is a uh, rolled gold Queensland. Queensland's crucial to Labor, and the SOS came as senior Liberals revealed their polls show Labor trailing in every key seat in the state, and Kevin Rudd's personal rating crashing, quote, through the floor since the campaign began. There's no one to keep the bastards honest. And that's the concern. If Tony Abbott wins this federal election, we'll have wall-to-wall -wall LNP from one end of Queensland to the other. That's just not fair, and it's just not good for Queensland. Peter Beattie's been recruited as much for his popularity right across Queensland and to focus on Premier Campbell Newman's weaknesses. He has a knowledge of this state second to none. The two have never been close. Mr Beattie's been scathing of Kevin Rudd's lack of political judgment, advised him to retire with dignity, accused him of treachery for undermining Julia Gillard. For me it's water off a duck's back. It doesn't really matter. Faced with a high-profile, much stronger challenger, oh, good to see you. the coalition immediately attacked. Another flim-flam man who hit people with record debt and deficit, who's just going to add to the leadership instability in, inside the Labor Party. Am I worried about Peter Beattie? Of course not, but I bet Kevin Rudd is. Peter Beattie says this is his toughest ever political fight, and he denies any ministerial or leadership ambitions. I am happy to be a humble backbencher, as all, you, as all of you know, I've been humble all my life, and that humility will continue. <laughs> the big announcement didn't go perfectly to plan, put back more than two hours, when the RAF transport mover carrying the media broke down on the Sydney tarmac. Lane Kelcutt, 9 News.